It's been about five years since John Aviri last featured for Harambe Stars and last night he marked his return with a stunner of a goal. This was the fourth goal of the night but my goodness we celebrated it like it was the first and uh, we discuss our under 20 team taking on Malawi and the chances of winning the Four Nations tournament. So stay tuned and watch until the end. Well, Malawi is going to hate us for a bit because we might win the Four Nations tournament at the expense of the Malawi team. And I say this because last night Harambe Stars beat the Malawi team 4-0 to progress to the finals. Personally, I think they, at some point, they actually were playing better football. Um, but the two quick goals by Olunga, <laughs> I think, put the Malawi team off. It was quite... Honestly speaking, it was ridiculous how we ended up in that situation. Two quick goals, no one would have seen that happening, especially in a tournament uh, with a host, with a host no less. And so that was that was incredible. I think Coach Ferrat was really happy with that. Um, it settled the team a bit. And so other than that, we were happy to see that the three senior players that we discussed in our previous video, the top five players to watch, the other two are from the Rising Stars, the under-20 team. The three senior players actually featured. We had Erambo, Richard Odada, and Ayunga came on later on for Michael Olunga, which was, well, he didn't... We were hoping for the next game that he could play a bit more, but still, just coming off and making his debut was big. Other than that, the key moments were, well, the two goals, the two early goals. Um, Patrick Matassi's save... Uh, this penalty should have shouldn't have actually stood, but anyway, Patrick Matassi made a ridiculous save, ah, and so we were able to finish the game <laughs> without conceding hey. a goal, which was big, which was really big. He made well, Patrick Matassi is really good. They actually made a comment about how he saved, you know, Sadio Mane's penalty in the last Afcon, and so when it comes to penalties, yo, Patrick Matassi is pretty decent, pretty decent, and of course the goal. The goal, the banger, John Aviris, um banger, I'm going to say fourth goal, but John Aviris goal, the fourth goal of the game was was also big. This was a ridiculous and even the celebrations were mad because you know it, it it was big. It meant everything for the squad, for the team, and for the player himself. And now on to today's game, which is Kenya versus Malawi for the rising stars, the under 20. Both teams have three points. They both beaten Mal uh, Zimbabwe. <laughs> Kenya beat Zimbabwe uh, three one, whereas Malawi beat Zimbabwe three two. So Kenya is top of the log, and this is because we're playing a round robin format because a Zambia pull out of the Four Nations tournament, and so each team is going to play the other and then see who is well the eventual winner at the end of it. So Kenya only needs a draw to win the Four Nations tournament for the under twenty. Category. This actually puts them in a really good position considering, you know, we've also now just beaten the, the, the Haramistas team has beaten the host comfortably. So they are so confident right now to just go there and well as Jose Mourinho will put it, let's go out there and get that draw. <laughs> but yes, pretty much, pretty much that's it. Um when it comes to uh, Kenya versus Malawi, we beat the host last night. With the Harambe Stars team and now today Kenya versus Malawi under 20 they only need a draw to win the four nations tournament and so we are in the well best position as it comes and as it's and we'll discuss more about this tournament format later on if this has put us in an advantage what an honor it is both teams technically in finals and so this is great to see um, I, t I said that the Kenya under 20 team would go further, but uh, let's see, let's see, let's see how it goes. I think we'll win it, to be honest, I think we'll win all categories and I said it in a previous video that this looks like a tournament that Kenya should win. Uh, no disrespect to the other teams, but uh, come on, we just beat some guys 4-0, the host. Anyway, I don't stop anything else. Do check out the other videos, by the way, the top 5 players to watch if you haven't checked it out. It's been mad. Um, we're hoping that Ayunga actually does more in the next game. But anyway, we are happy that we're in the finals. Anyway, that's been it for today's video. Do check out our other social media platforms at 
of me love football do like this video and subscribe to the channel and as always because we're big on it as always support kenyan football we out